I'm Jamie. And I'm Meredith, and we're with Coastal Business Supplies, and we're going to show you our athletic tube socks. Stay tuned. And we are back. So today in this video, we are going to be working with socks. So we are going to be working with our athletic socks. They are by Sublime. It comes with a pre-inserted jig, so make sure you keep that jig in place because it will assist with your pressing on both sides. So let's get started. Okay, we did our design in Photoshop and print using our F570. And we're gonna do the press and flip today. So fold your design in half and meet your edges up. And then center your sock. And I'm going to use the cardboard jig to tape it on there. Okay, I'm gonna pass this on to Jamie and I'm gonna go ahead and get the second sock uh, ready to go as Jamie gets it ready to press. So we are going to be using our Hydronics Fusion today, and I'm going to place this on the outer side so I have room for my other sock, but we are using a Teflon wrap, so this wraps around our bottom plate to protect our press. You can also use a silicone sheet. And just make sure, since it is a larger item, uh, we are working with a 16 by 20 press today that it just meets on the ends, so you don't have any overlap where you're not getting heat. Okay, perfect. Here is the second sock, so again, do about the same, make sure you're on the heat button. And we're just gonna cover with silicone just to, in case. Okay, so today we are pressing at 400 degrees in 60 seconds at a medium pressure. So uh, we're going to flip it now, and then make sure when you flip, you just hold both ends very carefully. Again, you, you do have thermal gloves just in case. Um, I'm touching the ends that haven't been pressed, so it's not too hot. Do our second one. You can just make sure you're good on your button and when it's located. Then we're gonna press again for another 400 degrees, 60 seconds, and a medium pressure. Okay, we're almost there, so I have my thermal gloves on. And it's a hot peel, so you're gonna just take off everything immediately. And be careful, because you don't want to make ghosting. There's one. And then we have two. And by doing the press and flip like we've shown you here, it does keep the gases in, so it does eliminate um, a significant line on your edges, so that does help with your design. Also, make sure that when you are designing them, it's a, a pattern that kind of um, flows together, so again, it will eliminate some of those lines. Good tricks. So now you have your finished product, so please be sure to check out our product instructions as well as templates available online at coastalbusiness.com, and we will see you next time. <laughs>